In and out of love, never get enough. We never seem to get older. Hey everybody, today is Wednesday, September 11th of 2020, and we're starting a new studio vlog today. Yay, this will be the second one. So hopefully this time will be more me, less pointing the camera at other things. Maybe more pointing the camera at other things. I don't know what I'm doing still. We're all learning around here. So I'm just gonna go ahead and stop rambling and let you move on to the next clip of the studio vlog. I hope you enjoy. Hi, welcome back to the studio vlog. Today, I've been working on trying to get things printed and my printer has decided to be a bit difficult today. Uh, it keeps jamming. It keeps saying that it doesn't recognize ink cartridges and then I have to put them back in and it recognizes it just fine. And then earlier when I was printing off some of my cards, it decided that it wants to not print full page with no bleed. And I have no idea why. I've updated everything that I can think to update. So I've been working on that today and I just have no clue. So I'm going to take a break from that and I think maybe work on maybe some stickers. I don't know. Maybe draw for fun. It is lunchtime. Maybe I need to just stop regroup and get some lunch because this printer is just, it's making me angry. And, uh, okay. Yeah. So hopefully that's not broken. I've had this printer for maybe four, four years now. And before I owned my sticker shop that I own now, I did like printables for planners. So I printed a lot of stuff out then to, to test. So it may just be getting too old. We'll see what happens later. I'm going to shut down my computer, restart everything, try to do better, do better printer. <sighs> see you later. So I realized that last time I said I would show you my products when they were finished and I never came back and did that. So I'm going to do some of the finished products this time. So this is one of my most recent. Let's see. It's a little pumpkin cat sticker. He's about, let's see if I can find a ruler. Let's see three and a half inches or so long. And then I did my little mushroom house. Let's see. Same thing, about three. That's usually what I try to do my die cut stickers as. And then this is how the mermaid shells, that's like a tongue twister, mermaid shells sticker sheet turned out. I really like this one still. It's really pretty. I love the colors. And this is the floral skulls. And then the fun fruit sticker sheet. I'm trying to not block all the light so you can still see. There we go. And this one is magical. All right, we've got the postcard, so it goes this way. And it's on glossy print paper. And then the postcard part is printed on uncoated, just matte, normal paper on the back. And then I went ahead and made a print of, of this. I went ahead and made a print of this. Uh, this is called Fire Bunnies and it's an illustration I did. I. Still not sure about this one, but I think it's kind of cute. So we'll see how that goes. Well, those are the things that I've got so far. I am working on like a thank you card, but I'm having so many issues with my printer right now. So this one's a little weird, but it's got the little pumpkin cat with this uh, like floral pattern mushrooms and then this printed upside down, but this is the back. So hopefully I can get these to work. I don't know why my printer is being difficult today. 
it just doesn't want me to print things. For some reason it's doing this. I don't know if you can see the white line. Yeah, there we go. This is supposed to be a no bleed print. Like my printer does no bleed. For some reason on this, it keeps leaving the white line. This is the exact same on the exact same Photoshop document and no line, but it is cut off. So it's stretching it, but there's no stretch setting set. And so I think maybe my computer might just be tired and need to be restarted or put to sleep for a while. Hopefully I'll get that worked out soon. We'll see. All right. As you can hear, I am actually working on cutting some stickers. I did a draw this in your style and I thought it came out so cute that I decided to turn it into a little sticker. I'm gonna go ahead and roll over to some footage of that. In and out of love, never get enough. We never seem to get older. When things are going right, you seem to have the time. But when it's hard, you just grow cold up. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. The words you be, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. Fires around ourselves. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. The words we be, cause we're scared of the silence. We should be good, but we keep lighting fires. Fires around ourselves. It's deja vu. Set up a stage of lights Say we're done, say it's over Shouldn't be coming back But somehow we cut back Acting drunk even though we're sober We should be good but we keep lighting fires The words you keep cause we're scared of the silence We should be good but we keep lighting fires Fires around ourselves We should be good but we keep lighting fires Get in silence. We should be good, but we keep out of fires. Fires round ourselves. It's deja vu. end of the day on Friday and this little guy just wants some attention uh, but I wanted to come back and update you on a few things I finally got my printer working oh he hit the camera okay that's better finally got my printer working um, I think I have a bad USB drive or USB port and so it was just constantly 
saying, oh, sending print, can't find printer, sending print, can't find printer, and it would just start flashing. But I moved it to a different one, and now that's working, and I'm not angry at it anymore, so that's good. Right now, I'm just gonna go ahead and work on editing the first day of this vlog. And, oh, I got my uh, ducky stickers all printed and cut. And I think you'll see that footage right after this clip. Hey everybody, we're back. I'm back with the new studio vlog. No, that's not right. Hey everybody, welcome back, I guess, for you, you've been here. There's only been a few seconds, but for me, it's been about a week since I last recorded. It's Wednesday, September 23rd, and I had to take a few days off because I got sick. And so, unfortunately, the studio log isn't gonna go quite as, the, not gonna go quite the way that I wanted it to, but that's okay. So I figured I would come in and like catch you up with what I've been working on, and then we'll go ahead and end it way I can start next week's. So since the last time we were talking, I've kind of been working on cutting a lot of things. I've been getting all my stuff cut. I went through all my old artwork to see if there's anything else I wanted to turn into stickers and I actually found a few things. So if you don't know, I've been like here in Texas where I'm at, quarantine started for me in March. And so in March we had, I work for a university in March I had spring break and I didn't go to work and then Whenever we came back, they were kind of just like, oh, by the way, we're just going to work from home. And so I've kind of been taking all the free time I have from that. I start practicing drawing, and so I've been getting a lot better. And so a lot of my old artwork, I'm like, oh, I don't know about this. I don't like it anymore. So I went through some of my old stuff and found a couple things that I like. And so I turned those into stickers. I drew a few new things. And then I also worked on like product photography. I also worked on like product photography and kind of making my YouTube intro and outro look a little bit more professional because I couldn't even think about that for my last video. So I thought it might be important to do it this time. And after that, I also worked on, hmm, let's see, what else did I do? Hmm, I don't remember. Oh, I did, um, I did my business cards that I'm gonna include with my orders. And so I sent those out and those should be here, hopefully, the 5th of October. Oh, and I got a stamp made and that should be here on the 1st of October. I'm not sure what else I've done. Hmm. A lot of work on my website. I've opened up a shop on Shopify before and so naively I went into this thinking, oh, it's fine. I've done this before. I know what I'm doing. And yeah, I guess that's right to a degree but also it's still a lot of work even if you know what you're doing so I've been slowly breaking through that to-do list and I think I've almost got everything done I did a lot of testing I think last week with like payments and orders and shipping and making sure that everything has tracking so I think I've got that figured out I have a few more listings that I need to make because that's literally my least favorite part of owning a shop is I don't like writing listings I'm starting to like product photography a little bit more than I used to, so that's nice. Other than that, I think today I'm going to work on getting those listings up and editing this studio vlog. I think that's everything I need to catch you up on. Whenever my packages come in, I think that'll probably be in the next studio vlog. I will go ahead and record them, that way you guys can see the cards and everything. And I think that's everything. So thank you so much for tuning in to the studio vlog and I will see you in the next one. Bye. In and out of love, never get enough. Hey everybody, today is Wednesday. No, not even close, Emily. Today is Friday, September 11th. And it's the first day I'm filming for the studio vlog, so I'm 